Hi guys, Model Muppet here. How are you doing? Today we're having a look at Assassin's Creed Black Flag mission to suffer without dying. Now the reason that I'm digging this up, because it's obviously you know, a fairly old game now, is that one of my subscribers had asked me if I could do it. Now I'm not too sure if it was meant as a challenge or if he wanted some help, but I love Assassin's Creed. I really do. I'm thoroughly enjoying playing it again. Every time I go back to it, I, I can't have so much fun. So anyway, yeah, I thought I'll do it again and I'll record it. Now, I did a couple of attempts on it. First attempt, I didn't actually have my capture card plugged in. And I, was, I just thought I'd give it a playthrough. And I did it perfect, right? And when I say perfect, I mean every kill was sneaky. You know what I mean? I was like stealthing through the whole mission. And I thought, yeah, this is a piece of piss. I'll do it again and I'll record it and I'll bung it up. You know, um, like I say, I don't know if it was for the challenge or I don't know if it's because he sort of needed some help but i thought i'd give it a go and and here we go so yeah you start off up in a cage there's nothing you can do about that bit and you get released i have a gift for you do not mistake my purpose here i have come for Anne and mary and you owe me nothing for this but if you would lend me your aid i can promise you safe passage from this place i'll need weapons Hell yeah, I need weapons. <laughs> and those weapons will do just fine. We must hurry. You know something really weird? It was only sort of as I got to the end of the mission that I noticed that you've got that blowpipe on the back. And when I went through it, I didn't um, I didn't use anything but the but the hidden blades. So this is where it all went wrong right at the start. Uh, I was intended to just go through and do this sort of stealthily. And as soon as I hop over the wall, I'm getting spotted. Uh, never mind, it's an opportunity to have a good fight. Now, the mission objectives here isn't to complete it without alerting guards or anything. So as long as you get through, it's not a problem. You do have to disable three of those alarm bells like that guy is ringing there. You've got to disable three of the alarm bells and then you've got to visit two old friends. So we're going to show you where those are. Actually, again, one of the things that I'm noticing as I go through this is I usually play with sort of a minimal HUD just because it's, it's kind of a better feeling. Um, so, for example, you'll hear him say, I've got a shot, but you don't get a button saying press X to use a human shield. And it's just little things, but I, I prefer it like that. I'm looking forward to Far Cry 4 for that reason, because apparently they're going to be able to allow you to completely eliminate the HUD. And I suspect that they're going to do the same on Assassin's Creed Unity. One of my recent comments, actually I just read it before I started playing this from a subscriber, was um, that Ubisoft are turning into his favourite developer. He's quite new to the Assassin's Creed series. Um, I, I kind of posted it back. I've got a love-hate relationship with Ubisoft. They definitely have two of my favourite franchises, Assassin's Creed and Far Cry. And I, I think they are awesome you know, series of games, but they have made some crazy decisions along the way. Um, I'm hoping, I'm hoping that Far Cry 4 is going to, to kind of make right that wrong, or make wrong that right. <laughs> yeah, make right that wrong, or make that wrong right. I don't know. So anyway, this, this guy here, he wasn't going to move from that spot. Wait, never mind, got him. Now, one kind of slight advantage of having that big fight at the, at the middle there is usually this this alarm bell is surrounded by guards. But as they'd all come running to that first fight, there's no guards there. And also, on the previous run through, you can see over the other side of this wall that I'm hiding behind here, there are guards there. And when I first played this, you know, just sort of like half an hour before doing the recording, there was no guards down there. Kind of interesting. So the guards probably aren't always going to be in exactly the same space. Although there did seem to be a few clusters that were exactly in the same place. 
So anyway, I thought from this point on, I'm just going to try and stealth it, you know, and, and not get seen. That guy in the cage there, hanging, that's, that's our first of our old friends that we need to visit. So that's why you need to come out this way. And you'll see you get a prompt there in You weren't much of a friend, need to Jack Rackham, nor an able sailor, neither. But you were strange and lively. And you made me laugh more than once. One thing that's kind of slightly odd about this monologue is it, it continues like no matter what you're doing. So if you I did end up getting into a big fight here, that monologue down there still continues. It's just kind of a little funny. And again, I, I, I get spotted. So much for my stealthy approach. Never mind, I should be able to pick this one guy off without getting into a big fight. He's off! Oh! Intruder! I need some help No, here. I get spotted again. <laughs> oh, I made an ass of it. There's the old alarm bells going. Now it's going to be really interesting when Unity comes because I mean you can probably tell most of these fights I'm winning just by doing the counter. Maybe he didn't run. And they're saying that with Unity you're not going to be able to get away with that. The counter is too much of a win button. So it's going to be interesting to see how that plays out. I'm just sitting here thinking, right, that's it, no more. Another one comes over. This one's quite good. with me. Missed my kill. Right now shut the fuck up and stay down, bitch. <laughs> Now, this particular tree can be a little awkward to get up to. I got up first time there, but just as a heads up, if you don't get it first time round, you know, give it another go and you should get there. Now, again, this bit, first time I played, it's entirely possible to just stealth through the whole lot. Don't ask me why I get that message about the license cannot be verified. I had to go back in and re-verify my licenses for some reason. It's kind of weird. But yeah, you'll see that message come up a couple of times. I'm not quite sure. So I'm looking at my map here and thinking about the alarm bells. And I couldn't remember whether I disabled to. But I had. So there's another bella just along here that we can get to. You there! No, you <laughs> and again I got seen. I so wish I'd recorded the first one. It was so much smoother. Never mind, it'll, it'll learn them. Ooh. In some way, it actually did make it a bit easier because this next bit that I'm going to go down into, now one of the guards is removed from there. So it might actually be a, a, a good way to go, you know, kind of deliberately get spotted and then pull back a bit, thin the herd, so to speak. So come down in here. And again, just like I didn't oh, want to land there, I wanted to land straight into the bush. Taking an arse of it yet again. So where were you staying prior to this assignment? <laughs> he just wasn't going where I was wanting him to go. <laughs> Anyone who's played Assassin's Creed games a lot will have had that experience, but I know. 
Yeah, you two guys have a little rest. Right, so that's the third bell sabotaged. Sabotage. Sabotage. It's a funny word, sabotage. So apart from the main mission objective, all we need to do in here now is find our other friend. And that's him you can hear sort of grumbling and groaning away. Again, trying to be clever, trying to be sneaky. Give a whistle. And he just doesn't want to come and play. those two spotted me then it didn't look like I was in the field of vision like at all I love those hidey hole kills though I mean these games they do have some sort of like little bugs and whatnot but they are like, a shit ton of fun to play So Globy Door over there is obviously where our second old friend is that we need to visit. So, I mean most people will get that one, it's, it's just the uh, the first one that's outside. That's, if you don't know where it is, it's a bit difficult to kind of just stumble across it. Hello, it's directly as I think the assassin that you're kind of supposed to follow, here. he goes off to the left didn't hear what happened after. rather than going to the right. You know like when I was outside the fort or something. Anyway, at this stage, I've given up with stealth. Right, I'm actually going to shut up talking now because I think this me. scene is actually really well done. Edward? So, I is hope you enjoyed fella? this video. I hope it it's might right, help you if you are struggling on 100% completing What's wrong with this. Mary? If you haven't She's seen in. the game, do, do watch this though because it's child. a good scene. I'm going to shut up now. Her. This is Wrap It Out. Ciao! No idea where. Oh, oh, oh. I know it pains the lady, but we must be silent. Can you walk? Uh, uh. Lean on me, Mary. Come on. Uh, I can't. Search every cell. Come on, that's it. You're all right.
Don't die on my account. Go. This is such a pain in the ass. Damn it. You should have been the one to outlast me. I've done my part. Will you? If you came with me, I could. Mary. I'll be with you, can't we? I will. What's happened to Mary? What's wrong? Is she gone? Oh no. Oh God! Oh. Uh. What will you do now? Nothing sensible. You haven't earned this, but they suit you. Good fortune to you, Edward Kenway. 